Hey, good afternoon. I'm Rob Hughes in for Karen Greer. We begin with a disturbing crime against the elderly, a man firing shots before robbing two women at a shopping plaza. 24 year old Bobby Kelsky of Hampton facing a judge right now. He's charged with several crimes, including possession of a firearm, aggravated assault and theft. It happened outside a dollar store on Terra Boulevard in Clayton County. Our Trayson Bragg joins us live from the scene. Trayson, really disturbing to target uh, two vulnerable women. That's right. I mean, this is a very disturbing story, Rob. And Kelsky is actually waiting to find out if he'll be granted bond or not. But as for that attack, it all happened right here. Take a good look. The Clayton County Sheriff's Office tells me this man, Bobby Kelsky, is locked up behind bars after targeting and attacking two elderly women. That's alarming. The attack happened here in the parking lot of the Dollar Tree in Lovejoy Wednesday. Investigators say Kelsky began carjacking the two senior citizens. And that's alarming for elderly people. I mean, I'm getting up there in age and I wouldn't want that to happen to me. I sure hope people were there to help her. But that's not all. Investigators say at some point, Kelsky pulled a gun, firing multiple rounds near the women's feet. That was necessary, especially for elderly people. I'm sure they didn't have a weapon. I mean, they could have just he could have just jumped in the car and gone his way and left them alone. He could have killed them. Moments later, he hopped in the women's car and sped off. The Clayton County Sheriff's Black Hawk unit caught him 10 minutes down the road at the intersection of Fayetteville Road and Tar Boulevard. Kelsky was arrested and his gun taken as evidence. Kudos to those uh, sheriff's officers, though. I really appreciate their their hard work and everything, and, and the police officers as well. Yeah. Now, in total, Kelsky is facing six charges. Get this, Rob. In addition to the charges you mentioned, he's also charged with driving with, driving with a suspended or revoked license. Reporting live in Clayton County, I'm Tracy Bragg, CBS 46 News. Yeah, it's a good thing they captured him, Trayson. Thanks for that report. If you